Wow. Well, first of all, I want to thank the uh, Sacramento State Alumni Association for this uh, tremendous honor. I'm looking at my table, and we have uh, two tables strong. And uh, <clears throat> I see my father, uh, Sacramento State graduate, uh, my girlfriend, Sacramento State graduate, uh, uncle, sister, best friend, uh, my sister, Chris. I'm sorry. Kristen went to UC Davis, so <laughs> I spoke to my mother in his punishment. This is going in her house for six months, this poster. <laughs> I was thinking quite a bit this past weekend about uh, this award and asking myself, how did I get here? You know, what were the milestones in my life that led me uh, to receive this great honor tonight? And I came up with three, and I just wanted to talk about those. I think the first is my education at Sac State. Uh, you know, back in 2005, uh, my senior project team was the first team to design and develop software for a mobile phone. And uh, we really were proud of that. But what made that really possible was the distinguished faculty of the computer science department, uh, the dean, the department chair. And uh, there are several professors that really influenced me, and I wanted to recognize them. Uh, Dr. Scott Gordon, who is uh, here tonight, uh, Dr. Clevenger. Dr. Scott Gordon, yeah. uh, Dr. Clevenger, and uh, Dr. Froge, who are very instrumental, and that was a huge milestone in my life. And recently, I, I joined the uh, technology agency, and I'm honored to have uh, Assistant Secretary Scott Patterson here tonight representing the agency. Um, what's most important to me is that three years ago, California's mobility program was founded by a Sacramento State graduate, and that's really what I'm really proud about. Lastly, the last milestone um, would have to be three very special individuals who really influenced my life, and I wanted to take the remaining time that I had tonight to recognize them and their efforts. Um, the first is my father, if he would rise just for a second. When I was in college, what I remember the most about my father was uh, he relieved me of numerous debts that I had to him so I could take very low-paying internship jobs and also supported me, so thank you, Dad. Uh, the next is my mother, Gail Grigsby. Stand up for a second. I had a lot of uh, medical problems in, in college, and I think if we were to count together, we probably went to the ER about 100 times, to the doctor's office, physical therapy, orthopedic surgeons, and whether it was at 1 or 2 o'clock in the morning, she was always there with me, uh, giving the doctor the evil eye to make sure he was treating me well, you know? <laughs> so thank you, Mother. And lastly is my grandmother, Regina Pavelko, if you would stand. We've never called her grandmother. We've always called her Nana, so I will call her Nana tonight. Um, from the early games of my youth of the endless Monopoly games to the, in my college when she would feed me almost weekly and board games and to the tremendous uh, financial assistance that she provided me in, uh, for college. I, I thank you very much. Um, thank you again to the Sacramento State Alumni Association. As I accept this award, please also direct your applause to these individuals because they were instrumental in my success tonight. Thank you. Thank you.